Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to more Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie Blind for the Nintendo 64. Uh, in the last episode... Do we have to collect these again? We have to collect the musical notes again? Really? Huh, okay. Alright, what was I saying? Yeah, in the last episode, we... Uh, came to the first level and collected a bunch of garbage. A bunch of random stuff. Which, obviously, we have to... Get again? Did I not save it? No. It's still there, because I still have the same amount of puzzle pieces. And the same amount of skulls, and the same amount of eggs. So you have to collect all the musical notes, and all the little... All the little, uh... Whatever you call them, again? That's kind of dumb. Unless, I mean, hopefully there's no big bonus for... Collecting all of them. Huh. Okay, so, what are we gonna do this episode? That is a good question. One thing I am gonna do... Oh yeah, I forgot that other bridge is over there. Oh well. Uh, I saw... No! In, um... In editing, the last episode, there is a little... Crevice... Slash cavern right up there, which I just failed at getting. So let me try to actually... Go do that bull. Stop it. That's not nice. Why do we have to collect all the musical notes again? Because they said something about musical note door. Let's see if I can fall into this perfectly. No, I cannot. Wait, wait. I can! Yay! Honeycomb. That doesn't help us. Like, they said something about a musical note door. Which you can die. <laughs> which, you know, is unlocked with all of, like, with half the musical notes or whatever. And then here's the, the orangutan guy, monkey, who needs to... There we go. I should probably stop standing on them as soon as he throws them. Throw one. Throw another one. Not there. There we go. Yeah, and I already got his puzzle piece. He's not gonna give it to me again. This monkey over here wants an orange. Chippy Hungry wants orange now. Feed Chimpy. Okay, so that either means you have to get the monkey to... The orange, or the orange to the monkey. Now, which one that is, I'm not sure. I would assume you have to get the orange to the monkey, considering the oranges move. Oh, and I'm also missing a, a an ability, a move, that the mole was yet to teach us. Because I've only found two of his three molehills. Which is kind of dumb, but okay. And I totally missed that orange one. Uh, I am stuck. Kind of. This would be a lot easier if I had a larger fan base to give me hints. But I do not. Unfortunately. And I need to heal before I go exploring anymore. I kind of just want to walk with Kazooie for the rest of forever. Because it's a lot faster. It's like a track meet. Hmm. And there's this pole here who... I still don't know how to shoot those stupid eggs. Or at least they look like eggs, I don't know. That's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. We already tried all this. But even if... It's still just a... A honeycomb up there. See, now I'm confused. I've pretty much... Pretty much covered the whole level by now. I've gotten... I mean, I've collected... Everything except for the... Let's see here. Except for the tokens, like the skull tokens. And the, uh, the, uh, uh whatchamacallit, the jiggies, the jigsaw puzzle pieces. And I'm, I mean, this is pretty much the entire area. I don't know, I don't know what else to do here. I mean, there's no, oh, there's, oh, there's, uh, there's the last molehill up there. Okay. Then we don't need an ability to get up there. Can I not high jump up there? Ah, oh, dude, I am so close to getting... I am bound and determined to high jump up there. No? Okay, how do we get into first person view? There we go. Let's look around. Monkey? Man, I do not know. I'm just not sure about anything. Okay, I want to try to catch... Oh, no, wait, there is a... There's an orange right here. Maybe I can knock that down, or is that just scenery? 
Aha! Okay, you can climb that. Okay, cool. Now that we figured that out, <laughs> the orange, <laughs> the orange has a voice. That's awesome. Oh, Chippy liked Congo's orange. Chippy helped fat bear and bird. We fuck you too. Okay, cool. Now that that, oh, we get a puzzle piece as well. So, eat that for me, please, Kazooie. Now we have seven. Now I can get up here and grab these eggs. I assume this is the point where he shows us how to shoot the eggs. Okay, teach us. Time for the buzzer to learn the ancient ways of the egg. Thank you. I'm listening, Beetle Breath. Hold Z, then press the top C button to shoot an egg out of your mouth. Hey, sounds cool. Anything else? Sure, press the bottom C button instead, and you can shoot them out from behind. <laughs> Sounds painful, which I'd never asked. Exactly. Bird brain can carry 100 eggs in her backpack. Oh, and you can also use the control stick to aim while you were crouching egg sighting, huh? Now that you've learned to use the eggs, here's 50 to practice with. But I've already collected a bunch. Whoa, Banjo, there's nothing more I can teach you on this world. On this world, ah, so we obviously learn more things as we progress into different areas. There's a third token. And here is a switch. Really? Oh, neat. Okay, how do we get up there? I wonder. Well, not with any of the abilities we already have, I assume. But... Okay, so now we have three of those tokens. Need two more. I wonder if I have to leave the area, because the area is very... I mean, it's very barren. But that wouldn't make any sense. I assume that they would... See, now let me... Did I ever get this guy last time? I don't think I did. Death to you. Yeah, all it gives me is life refill. Well, let's try out this egg shooting, shall we? That's not... I didn't want to fart the egg. There we go. There's one. Gonna get progressively faster, I see. He just coughs it right out. There we go. No miss! Puzzle piece. I was supposed to get a... a, a whatchamacallit? A honeycomb, too. You gypped me. Oh, it's still up there. I see. Oh, I know what I should have done. I should have jumped on one of them. Damn it. I missed my opportunity. Huh. See, I'm trying to figure out if there's anything on top of his hut. Or what have you. Oh, hey, there's an opening right here in the side of this mountain. How the hell was I supposed to know that? Hey, ugly! No bears allowed in Ticker's anthill, I'm assuming. I don't care, though. So apparently I'm ugly and I'm fat. The enemies in this game call you names. Oh, crap. Okay, well, there's the fourth uh, token. Is this climbable? No. I have to make it up this way. Oh, I need to use... Uh, Kazooie's ability here. Can I jump while you... Yes, I can. Okay. There's one. Oh, man, that's really steep. Um, let me look around. First person! And there's tons of shit up there. Interesting. And there's no way to climb the vines? Am I sure? Am I sure sure? What am I, Cedric the Entertainer? Ah, uh, well, shit. Well, I just need one more. I need one more more. And I'm gonna make sure... Is it up there? It probably is. How do I drop down... into there? Because there's no openings I can that I can see, anyway. Is that an opening up there? I can't see. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna search around the base. Die, Ant. I'm gonna search around the base of this place. No rhyme intended. To see if there are any other openings that I might have missed very blatantly. No. Well, let me get at it from a distance and look and see if I missed anything. Ah, there's a puzzle piece up top. Let me go to the other side and look, actually. Run, Kazooie! On delay. Okay, we're almost there. We're making pretty good progress. Or at least as, as good a progress as we can in a blind LP. 
Huh. So there's a way to get up there. Apparently, I just don't know how. See, what were the moves we learned? We learned... We learned how to ground pound. We learned how to shoot eggs out of our ass. Thank you. And... What was the other one? Oh, the, uh... The Kazooie Walk. None of which, I assume, are going to help us in this situation. There's got to be something in here I'm missing. Because there's, like, literally no other way... I mean, it kind of looks to me like I have to go very quickly around the edges and then climb up, but I don't see any holes in the vines up there. No, and see, that third one is, like, basically impossible to traverse. Can Kazooie climb? No, she cannot. See, now that, mm, that third one. What do I do? I'm frustrated. <laughs> and so... He became frustrated. Oh, well, I'm not seeing it. No? Oh, hey, I can... Whoa, hey, I can wall jump. Or was that just my imagination? No. Wall jump for me, Kazooie. No? Really? Does it involve shooting an egg? How did it say I aimed with the uh, egg shooting? I forget. See, that's... There's, ob there's another C button that we're missing. It really disturbs me how he, sh how he shits eggs. I don't get why that's an ability. See, now... Banjo just falls off just as soon as he sets foot on it. Huh. Let me take one more look up there. Maybe that's it. Maybe I'm supposed to climb right there. Damn it. Tell me there's some sort of... Clingy action. Ah, oh, screw it. I can't figure this out. See, that wh what's going through my brain here is... You know, basically... The game is screwing me over because... This is kind of impossible to figure out. Or maybe I'm just really stupid. I don't know. I mean, I... I'm a common sense kind of guy. Whenever something in a video game... Like, happens or... or rears its ugly head that takes an illogical way of figuring to solve, then it confuses the hell out of me. Okay, let's go back in here to into, to Mumbo and see what... See, he's sleeping. What you, will you give me a hint of how to get up there? Can't have magic. Look at sign. Go away. Bring more. Well, that's helpful. Uh, I'm missing anything in here? Ah, there are eggs up there. Maybe there's another token up there. Just maybe. Maybe I have to jump on... Okay, that. The fire hurts you? Really? Can I look up here? Yes, I can. Just eggs, huh? Nothing else? Can I jump on the back of your head? No. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to collect a bunch of musical notes until it indicates to me again that I unlocked whatever some kind of door and see if anything else unlocks. So I'll be right back. Aha! Those bastards hit that thing well. Okay. So after millions of years of searching, I've finally found... The last token. Wow. Okay. Okay. See, that wasn't a that wasn't an act of stupidity or, or bad game design. That was very good game design, actually. As you can see, I cleared out all the huts. I went and found all five of those little Kazooie look-alike things, just doing my best to try to find something in this level. Okay, we have all five. What's cracking, Mumbo? Ah, Banjo has plenty tokens. Stand on skull and press B to see mighty Mumbo magic. Okay. Cool. Let's, let's do it. Okay, I'm floating. Why am I floating? <laughs> oh, I'm an ant! 
Oh! Almost magic. Free to change back. You come when ready. Termite bit small, but not bad for first spell. Okay, so these are termites, not ants. Okay. <laughs> yes! Do I still have all of my abilities? So I assume with this termite ability, I'm going to be able to climb these steep slopes. I would assume. Yes. And I fall. Is there a double jump? Or am I just going to have to time that really, really well? Or can I climb this? No, I cannot. Man, I cannot jump. Is it because I'm white? Is that... Oh, game? Nah, I can't jump at all. <laughs> Not that I can't jump well, I just can't jump at all. Okay, there's that one. There's that one. Aha! Okay. Neat. Hey, where did you get those shorts? I want them. No, you can't have my shorts. Okay, there's all 100 musical notes. You just passed your best note score for this world. Okay, what does that mean? You found all 100 notes on this world. Well done. Thanks. What did I get for it? Nothing? Nothing at all? You're telling me that was a meaningless, pointless action that I just I just did? Give me that cool backpack or else. Um, no, my backpack. Is Kazooie also a termite? Or did we both turn into termites at the same time? Or what? Hey, there's an opening. And there's an extra life, which I'm going to barely grab. And they said there are, what, ten puzzle pieces in, in one world? So that's, okay, nine. I can't possibly think of another one that we can go and get. You know, let's actually go. Let's fall all the way down. Can you take fall damage when you're a termite? Did I just miss that, or, or what? Probably can. I would assume so. Maybe. It didn't make a noise, though. I didn't notice. Okay, let's go turn back to Banjo slash Kazooie. Not Termite Man. Change me back, please. Please, Mumbo. Thank you. <laughs> it reminds me of Aku. Is that it? Pretty sure that's his name. The mask from Crash Bandicoot? Oh, it takes all of our tokens away, too. But didn't he say we can use that anytime we want to? Okay, we have nine... Nine, count them, nine puzzle pieces. Now, actually, what I'm going to do, since I saw another way, I'm going to use the exit pad. I'm going to go back, and I'm going to check the other way. Oh, actually, the tenth. For the hundred you just collected counts as your best note score. Try to get a hundred on each world, as they are needed to open the note doors. Okay, I don't know what a note door is, but I assume... Can I use? No, I cannot. Interesting. I could have... Well, then what else am I supposed to do? If I can't use his steep climbing ability to get up this mountain to get that puzzle piece, because he said there are ten in each world, and that would make ten for us right there. Interesting. What I wanted to come and look at, actually, was there's a pathway to the left. I want to see if there's any gateways over here. Uh, obviously I have to climb it with Kazooie. If there are any gateways or something. Yeah, there's a note door. We have to have 50 musical notes. Okay. I'm gonna restock on health right before we go through here. Hey, it's the mole. This is a note door sealed by Grunty with one of her powerful musical spells. Open it up, then jam jars. <laughs> it's not that simple. To open it, you must collect the musical notes from the worlds. <laughs> the number on the door is the strength of the spell. The combined total of all your best note scores from the worlds must be at least this to break Grunty's magic. Okay. I think we have just about enough, but actually, I'm not 100% sure on how much time I will have to cut out of the middle of this episode, but we are going to break open our first note door in the next episode. So until then, I'm Broken Champion. We're done here.